<laughs> oh, I feel like I should have dressed differently for this one because I should be dancing in studio. Amazing energy right there. I feel that's like the, the way real African women actually sound and feel. <laughs> and, and in our households, I think in some counties in Kenya, women are, 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 <laughs> are coming out very strong in households. Anyway, I'm just saying I love the energy all the way from Uganda. I have a nyabo. <laughs> I, have, I have a nyabo in studio. Uh, so I'm really trying to pull something here. Je, jebali nyabo. Jebali kwa nyabo. Hey, uh, hey. The way you said it. It, it is correct. <laughs> it's correct, yeah. <laughs> wow. I didn't hey. expect that you'd be sounding this soft. Is this the same person? You expected to have very hardcore dancehall artists, right? My team is like, no, <laughs> man. And maybe drop them something so we can confirm that it's really you. <laughs> Try an acapella or something so that I have not betrayed you guys. It's really her. Just drop something. To fit a tulina dot a paper. To dig it, baby, we zibu to lava yeta. To kuban dig it, she chat a bit to get. The tweet of a son's a tweet of a waiter. How about that? Did you say it's a waiter? Yes. <laughs> okay. <laughs> like, All we right. don't call haters, we call the waiters because we need to party. Yeah. Oh, we call waiters, we don't call haters. Yes. Hey, I'm no longer <laughs> saying hi to haters. Waiters, hi waiters. Please, <laughs> later, here we say letter, letter, waiter, letter, waiter. waiter. Yes. Um, your music, mm -hmm. your, 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 let me start with your style. Um, I was literally counting them. <laughs> I know we things. don't have a lot of time. My producer says, Anki, go straight to the point, but one, two, three, four, turn around, five, <laughs> six. Seven. How many piercings <laughs> do you have? I have. I, I think I could say about 40. Yeah, oh, about to clock 50. Yes. <laughs> and that's art for you. That's art for you. Yes. And also pain for me. Of course, it, every art comes with pain, even singing. Mm -hmm. Sometimes it comes from the deepest. So mm -hmm. yeah, every art has come, somehow comes with a little pain. I like yes. that. So you're an artist, and you do know that your journey has had some pain to it. Yes. Share your journey as an artist. East African artists and the pain and the challenges that came with it and how you overcame it. Um, I am Shivana, Jumbo Kenya, I Jumbo forgot. Nairobi. I <laughs> <laughs> yes. Jumbo Kenya, Jumbo Nairobi. I am Shivana. I come from Uganda and I'm so, so happy to be in Nairobi. Uh, being welcomed in a very, very nice way. <laughs> uh, I started my music career as um, uh, a dancer as an actress uh, before I started singing. And uh, I used to do more of dancehall and, uh, you know, mostly entertaining before, you're talking about career building yes. and all that. Oh, nice. But before I, I got into, you know, even learning to make money as, you know, as an artist, uh, not just a musician, it, it came through different levels and processes, yeah? yeah. From a dancer to, you know, having all these challenges as a female dancer, you know, an actress, and then finally finding myself and my voice and choosing my path of, okay, let me try dancehall. Mm -hmm. It wasn't really trying dancehall because that's the energy that I have, but also just realizing that, okay, I, can, I could also use my voice, you know, to do something better, like uh, advocate for, for a change other yeah. than just entertaining people so it has been a growing process and yeah here we are <laughs> how, how do you say how do you say good job in 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 in, in baganda uh, <laughs> good job it have become a kenyan apparently yeah you know, i was going to go there because apparently she lives here and i was going to ask you why do you love kenya so so much some of us are looking for visas <laughs> to go to uganda to 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 ugandan <laughs> places why kenya you love kenya that much i love kenya so much i love kenya uh, Kenya is just full of too much love. The vibes, uh, like, I, I think if you compare the other countries that you go to mm -hmm. around Africa, it's much, much easier to feel at home right in Kenya than any other place. And I like, like that yes. your, your word goes around Africa. Africa, she has a new jam. Uh, we're going to talk about Africa, Nalia. Yes, Africa, Nalia. And when she says Nalia, I know a lot of Kenyans are asking. <laughs> I don't think I was asking, did, did she say Nalia or Nalia? <laughs> oh my God, it's yeah. Africa Nalia. It, it, Nalia. Yes. All right. So we're <laughs> going to talk about that. That's the new German. It's hot and it's 
dope and it's everything in the energy that you're seeing right here in studio. Mm -hmm. um, wh how was the journey, the inspiration behind African Nalia? Because I've had you, you know, acknowledge activists in that music. I've, mm. I've, I've had so much positive, you know, vibe in that music. W what really inspired African Nalia? So African Nalia is a song that celebrates Africa's beauty. Okay. and the liberation of us as Africans coming out of slave trade, but also creating awareness against human trafficking. And the inspiration came from a personal story. Okay. I, I, I say it openly that I am a survivor of human trafficking. Yes, I say it openly that I am a survivor of human trafficking, and I do not just say it. Like, I've always made it clear that I do not say this because I'm trying to gain pity from people, but because I know it's very important, human trafficking and the modern slavery, slavery has really become a thing now, and it's very important. A, a survivor or a victim out there will listen to me, you know, and, and actually know, I, I will come through out of this, you know, even if they're still in uh, captivity, whether it's a survivor, it somehow gives them hope, mm -hmm. and I know how important that that is for you know, survivors and victims of human trafficking. So African Alia is just an inspiration that was my own story and also part of my journey of growing as an artist. Mm -hmm. Like like I said, I, uh, I got, I've gotten to a point where I feel that, you know, music is very, yes. uh, very, very important and it comes from the heart. Mm. You have to have the passion. But also just besides entertaining, I feel like as musicians, we can play a very, very big role in changing the world, changing the systems that are broken and doing all that, in, uh, like despite just entertaining people. You know, this is WCW and having such a strong voice coming from a woman this morning. Do I need to say anything more? Do I even <laughs> need you. to advocate even further? You you know, you have said it for us. You have shown that we can be on the forefront. And now I understand why you can take so many piercings. Even inside your soul, you're a strong woman. A very strong And woman. going through that trafficking and coming out of it and speaking for people. Look, yes. this is definitely evident that you can live for, you know, uh, for impact. Yes. Now, I know I want to play the African song, but you want to big up the team behind it. Yes. Yeah. Most definitely. I would really, really want to say thanks to uh, the organization that I work for. It's called Azadi. Azadi is an organization, um, is uh, a survivor-led organization for survivors uh, of... Um, led by survivors mm -hmm. for survivors of human trafficking. Okay. You can follow them on all social media platforms. And I would love to thank uh, the Skay Lucky Gang that has really pushed my music. It's, it's also a woman behind it, so nice. we know women empowerment all the way, <laughs> which is very nice. I would like to, to thank the entire team, Sophie Otiende, uh, Antonia, Thank you guys so much. Pumi, thank you so much for coming through for me and also making sure that survivors of human trafficking are catered for and you know you work with them through all the journey of you know coming back to the society and building their lives again. Mm. Yeah, and also uh, you can follow me on my social uh, social media pages of course. I am Shivana, Sh Sh Shivana on Facebook. Uh, on YouTube, you can follow me on Shivana Music. On Instagram, you can follow me on uh, Shivana underscore music. <coughs> Twitter, the same, Shivana underscore music. And we'll have fun. You have a lot of entertainment to have and also educative stuff to learn. You know, I feel like I yes. should sit here and I should sit there. <laughs> <laughs> this is, this is, why? Because it is evident, you know, in Kenya, Nasema, come Zurim Zu. <laughs> hey, and your music starts with drum rolls, you know, when they said Africa, and do, do, do you know, and I'm going to do those drum rolls for you because I think for some reason you should also be a radio TV show host. For a, for a moment there, I rested. I was like, oh, please take over my job. Oh, my God. <laughs> so I'm, I'm, I'm so glad that you have come. You've given up your social, um, you've given out your social handles. So I say, I just said, I'm going to Kiswahili. Mm-hmm. Kiswahili. Fuata, hey, follow her on social media platforms as in Fuata. You know, it's Fuata, hey, handsome. You know, it's Fuata. <laughs> <laughs> on IG, support Kenyans. I know how you give, you know, that kind of support. Yes. Kenyans are a lot of love, by the way. I know oh there are a lot God, of yes. energy. A lot of it. Wow. I have received it. So show that love, guys, right here from WCW Edition. Go there and comment. I saw you on the WCW Edition. 
hata mimi mtanibamba mkiandika hivyo eh na usiwe tu Kenyans women for for Kenyans Kenyans for Kenyans Kenyans for Uganda lakini the love is love yes, yes, so you're going to yes. drop africa for me before we um in in acapella kidogo mm -hmm. and then drop the song officially cuz yes, cuz sure. you're the queen mom you're, you're the queen shine yes jambo jambo bwana eh mzuri zuri sana eh ma my Africa, I'm beating my drum on the African rhythm. Thanking our forefathers for blessing our land. For wearing the waves through calamity and crimes. Living my days in African time. Tell me, Ghana and Cuba. Ebibira no musana, lunch is in Juba, o bulunji bo bebunkuba, mama na ye. Mama Africa, mama Africa, let's rise and save the land. Oh, <laughs> mama Africa, let's, let's rise, rise and save, save the land. land. Yeah, yeah, mama. Okay, let me show you. Okay, 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 okay. <laughs> you know, I, I will, I will decide to go and join Shaker on Friday because you're pushing me towards entertainment Friday. Come again on Friday, by the way. We have rice today on Friday, oh, sure, and sure I'm I telling Shaker this morning. This is energy you need on that show where i'm saying i know so you can drop <laughs> africa i will dance here with you perform i know the viewers are like anki when i and i want to close the show as well but before i do that let's move to this jump yes <laughs>